What's up, worship boy Iconic? Back again with another video. Yes, sir, we are back in the Iconic Studios, back with another banger, back with another review. Before we get started with this review, y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and also that notification bell so you can stay in tune with the reviews, the on feats, the sneaker vlog, the sneaker news, and everything else that comes with the channel. Thank y'all for watching, man. Not gonna waste any more time. Let's get into it. Boom, we have it here. A box directly from Nike. Um, I did pick these joints up last week. I did hit, I don't think it was a draw. Or was it a draw? But I did hit on these joints. You see what's going on. You see the box. You see everything that's on the actual box. I'll go ahead and give y'all a quick 360 of the box. I love it. it uh, definitely screams collaboration for sure. Y'all already know I'm working on this morning video, y'all. So don't mind me. If I'm all over the place with this joint, man. If I'm all over the place with this joint. But uh, it is a paddle box. Um, this one's a little different, though. I've seen a lot of people hit on a lot of pairs. I'm glad that people are getting Ws. But this was a little different. Box level reads. Nike Air Max 1 slash P. Colorway is metallic silver. Rush maroon. Argent metallic. Uh, retail on this joint was 170 And it is a size 11. My personal size. But I don't know if I'm going to keep these or not, man. Let me go ahead and show y'all. The actual box label right there for anybody that's trying to do any legit checks or anything of that nature. Box label right there. Hopefully that's focusing out real good for y'all. Um, there it is. There it is. Flip the lid. I definitely love the box. Um, there is a lot number. There's a lot number right here in the box. Hopefully y'all can see that again. I'm on a monitor, y'all. So don't mind me. I'm on a monitor. So it's red, right here, y'all. Right here on the box. Right here, that's that lot number. This is how the paper looks when you receive the shoe. This is how it should be wrapped up. Here's the paper all the way around. It looks like a fish, y'all. Yeah, it is a fish. It is a fish right here. Ooh, nice. Nice little uh, details right there. Loving that. And that's it in the box. Team powder right there. Let's get into the shoe. Boom, we have it here. The Air Max One Pata. Rush Maroon, um, one of many colors. Um, they have been releasing a lot of colorways of the Pata Wave releases. I believe there was like an orange colorway and a blue colorway. Um, I know a lot of people have been fiending for like a green colorway because I guess the original chlorophyll Pata releases like people's grills. And I like that colorway actually as well, but off rip, we have this one right here, man, in the Rush Maroon colorway. And let me tell you, looking at this in first glance, um, it just has this type of shine to it. It's not any suede, it's all leather right here where you see like that that um, maroon colorway at. It's all leather, which I like. I like that whole touch right there. Boom, I'm liking it, man. Let's go ahead and do a quick review, y'all. Bottom, is that maroon? Bottom is maroon, very maroon. It, should look, it may look brown on camera, but it is maroon right there. Midsole is cream all the way around, not white cream. I believe the insole is cream as well. Go ahead and zoom in on that. Oh, go ahead and zoom in on that. Uh, air unit is cream as well. Upper. Upper is again mostly maroon and it does have like this gray mesh um, in the middle. As you can see there is, uh, there's not a original Air Max 1 layout when you talk about like the toe cap area of the sneaker. It is laid out like some waves and I never really learned the whole full layout of why they did that design on the sneaker. But I think it's dope. I think it's a dope touch um, to the Air Max One. It makes it pop a lot. Um, back here, you do have maroon hits, which are hits of orange. Um, I don't think orange was a good playoff with this sneaker. I don't know why they put orange on this. Um, I probably would just prefer like some white or silver hits. That's just my personal opinion. Um, guts are orange as well, as you can see. Orange guts. Uh, comes with that maroon lacing right there as well. Right there you do see there is a maroon swoosh with a, sel uh, a silver with a silver lining behind the swoosh. Thought that was pretty dope about it. Um, feels kind of leathery, not sure. Um, but on lateral and medial side, you do have that uh, lining of that silver swoosh underneath the leather maroon swoosh. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else about this shoe? What else? Oh, you do have your little white uh, White or gray maybe gray maybe white. I'm not sure but you have your white swoosh right there on the toe 
uh, cap as well. Again, like I said, toe box is mesh uh, all the way up. And then you have some mesh lining right here. Up here around the ankle area, you also have some gray meshing as well. And again, um, if most people don't know about Air Max 1s, very, very, very comfortable shoe. As far as sizing, in my opinion, I always go a half size up on all my runners because I have a wider foot. So if you look at me like my Air Max 95s, um, or any Air Maxes in general, I usually go up to a size 11. I wear a true 10 and a half. People with more narrow feet can probably go true to size, but if you have a wider feet and you uh, you have trouble when you wear narrow shoes, I would either go a half size or a full size up. I think for a fact, a half size up is perfect. Um, let's go ahead and pull out the insole, y'all, so we can kind of get to this and wrap up the video. Here is the actual inside of the insole. Sneaker, it does say Pata on the shoe insert you do have a sizing tag right there um, on the tongue it also says pata hopefully that focuses up for y'all boom boom you also say pata right there definitely nice little touch right there um and here's the inside of the sneaker right there and so and that's about it man i don't think this shoe will be faked plenty of pairs out there um as far as extra laces they do have Another set of laces, like a darker maroon or burgundy color right there. Um, I, again, I don't know why they hit this shoe with the orange hits. Um, maybe it probably would have hit more orange laces. I'm not sure. I don't know why they did the orange hits in this shoe. It's okay. Um, and then it did come with a little bracelet. Um, it does come in this like little pouch, this pad of pouch. Hopefully y'all can see that. Hopefully that focuses. Let's see. Let's see y'all there you go boom so right there you got that little powder bag right there open it up and it does come with like a little bracelet which looks pretty dope and i high key want to keep <laughs> i high key want to keep it just because but i'm not going to keep it if i do get rid of the shoe definitely going to make sure the person receives this and it's nothing hold on it's nothing too crazy at all just like a little bracelet nothing too crazy y'all what y'all think but yeah man that's about it man for this sneaker y'all let me know in the comments what y'all thought about the air max one pata rush maroon nothing too crazy again nothing too crazy about this sneaker it is definitely a nice sneaker i think the colorway is nice very great fall sneaker that you can pull out right about now um, y'all let me know in the comments did you pick up this shoe um, I don't see this going up too too crazy resale I know the other colorways will but right now this is one of those shoes you might have to sit on to see some resale me, me personally I don't think I'm gonna keep it at all um, I hockey want to try it out on feet but um, I'm just gonna probably sell it to somebody that really likes this shoe man I like to give y'all a review and if I'm not gonna keep it I like to get the shoe to people that actually enjoy the shoe and want to wear the shoe than to actually, uh, you know, pop them across the head, you know what I mean? So certain shoes like this that's going for like retail, I want to take care of somebody for retail, you know, who really wants it or somebody that's been really eyeing the shoe. But again, man, we have it here, the Air Max 1 Pata. Very nice shoe. Y'all let me know again in the comments what y'all think about it, what you think about resale. Do you think it's hot? Do you think it's garbage? And did you pick this up or did you pass? Thank y'all for watching, man. Before y'all go, y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and also that notification bell so you stay in tune with the reviews, the on feats, the sneaker blog, the sneaker news, and everything else that comes with the channel. Yes, we are in the Iconic Studios. I have a new light setup, so get used to seeing this little setup, baby, because y'all don't have to wait to see me in the daytime no more. We can set it up at any time. So again, let me know what you think about the video as well. You know how it goes down over in my channel. The future belongs to those who prepare today. Till tomorrow, y'all. Peace.